E weche matimore aluora mag counties wa makaluo kwa chako kod county noero ma migori, ajaud bura ma suna west migosi pita masara onyiso jotelo mawuoke gwenge goeko mag imbo mar Kenya mondo uwogi duola chela kendo giwere kod gigo manyalo kelo pogruo ke kindgi ne ikruo kane yero mar higa manyena. Moluor Masara e seche mane ochiwo bas mara school mara nyangumbo monye ugi CDF e nengo mara miliona abirio. Owa chonisa ose chopo majo pinyo nego beda kicha kendo owe regi siyasa noero manya loke lopo gruoka. Bende owa choni chenro ose chakore marke loka nyakla jotelo duto maga gwenge goeko kagi geto bedo kanya chela e yero maduonga mara higa manyena. Omedo oko kwa yujo siyasa mawoke gwenge goeko mondo oie osir luedo o gai mar ODM mulu Raila Odinga. Eseche mabende otemo tieko projects mabende no chaka kod kere uhuru Kenyata. From as early as 1950 when people were struggling for independence, our heroes were there. But when the cake was brought on the table, to be honest, we only tasted it but we did not eat the cake. We have struggled to join the table, but all the time we have been a menu. This time round, the gods of Israel and the gods of Luora Mogi have spoken, and they have said Raila is going to be the president. Nobody is going to derail our vision, the vision of Raila Molodinga to be the president of this Republic of Kenya. We must unite as a people for we to be supported by other like-minded personalities in this country. And I want to say that if we have a good leader, we have a good nation. And time has come, Mandela time has come for Raila to be the president so that the people of Kenya can choose between a leader and a propagandist. As we stand now, we can't talk about somebody who promises heaven and does not even deliver hell. I won't say that. People who are in the office, like me, we should not talk, be talking of what we are going to do, but we should be telling people what we have done while in the office. Because whatever we have done is, how, is what can be used to gauge our leadership skill and power to propel us to the next level. Don't fear Raila. Raila is a God-sent leader, very humble. And ma uh, to, to make matters worse, he was detained for nine years. Not that he robbed somebody's money or he killed somebody, but he was detained for nine years when the family was suffering to create the democratic space we have today. Raila has fought for devolution, which other people are talking about bottom up, and they don't understand because they are not economists themselves.